part two of our holiday so we are actually staying at sandstone point this time so we've traveled further up and i believe it's in between sunshine coast and noosa so it's quite a while up so i don't really know our whereabouts of like how we're going to travel home so it's probably a good six seven hours i guess i'm not actually quite sure i'm terrible with location so sandstone point is beautiful it is literally like a resort it is so nice they've got three pools they've got like a water park they've got games room tennis courts beautiful little playground big jumping pillow mini golf uh did i say go-karts they've got a we haven't been to it yet but it's called the oyster shed so it's like a a restaurant down off the water which is off their hotel so we're staying in our caravan um, as you may know from our last vlog but we are just staying on a site and then we have a very close site to like all of the amenities and stuff so that is really nice and then good job good job are you just having fun on your holiday yeah yeah well dad's back now so we're going to have some lunch and, and we at sandstone. Sandstone. You having fun, Dad? Yeah, mate. Yeah, mate. it is now Sunday I've just done a workout in their gym it is actually very cool I'll give you a little tour in a minute um, but I just did just a random little workout this morning just enough to like move my body my back has been really sore and I don't know if it's from not being consistent in my routine with the gym or because like but this is why I have to actually do exercise because I have a bad back so it was really good to just do a little bit of something this morning it's actually nice because I've got the whole gym to myself currently so I'll flip you around and I'll give you a little tour. So this is just like a little window spot with some green grass. So like people can sit here, little watering vendor thing. So I just did my little um, few bits of workout just here. They've got some weights. And then over there, they've got some more weights. They've got some like uh, weighted balls, some barbells, bikes, treadies. They've got mirrors all the way around, which is really cool. It just gives a bit of illusion that it's a bit bigger. 
Um, and then they've just got some equipment over there, which I didn't use. I just used mainly the benches and I just did some weighted exercise TV if you want to watch. So yeah, that's all I did this morning and gonna head back now, have a coffee and some brekkie. Don't know what we're gonna do today. So I think it, there's a festival on currently, not at the moment, but today there'll be a festival. Um, what's it called? I can't remember, but there's a festival on here, um, like a concert, literally over near the oyster shed that I showed you yesterday. We went for a little wander through that you gotta go through the pub and then you go down into this awesome cafe. It was so nice. We'll probably have some lunch or some dinner there at some point, but it was really nice. I really enjoyed that. Um, just having a look. Anyway, so I'm gonna go and see what the family wants to do today. Hopefully it's nice weather. What do you got here, Chloe? Donkey. What is it? Donkey. What? Found what we're looking what? for in life. He's hungry. He's hungry. That's crazy, but things are fine. Oh, you put it on your head. Do you want another few? No. Hey. Lock you, Ari. Look, he's looking for you. We got it now. We don't need no more. Even in the hard time, you and I can weather any storm. Before I sleep, hear the crickets, see the moon. Side by side and through and through. Hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy But things are finally right With you and I The future is bright oh, You and I, we got it oh, We don't need no
over your hand. Oh, it tickles. <laughs> no, no, no. He's so gentle, but he's like, he's, he's got like big, um, big lips. Oh. <laughs> What'd you get, mate? Um, sheep. Um, a monkey. A monkey. Is that a puppet? A puppet. A puppet. What'd you get, Chloe? A puppet. Show, Mum. Okay. Quack, quack. Did you have fun at the farm? Yeah. Yeah. Ari, did you have fun? Yeah. Super yep. fun. Super fun. Good job.
fantastic. We are bypassing the park though. Kids are over there because they have ice blocks and then we'll have food on the island. <laughs> Probably because the animals will eat it. What is this flower? I've never seen any fly like it. time on our holiday it was very much needed and I'm so glad that we we're finally able to do it because it's been many years in the making that we've been able to go and actually spend some time like that out in public I guess you could say because it's just been a few hard years with our eldest so it's been nice for him to be able to be at an age where we can actually go out and do stuff like that so we ended up staying at we we came we came up on a Saturday after I finished work so we stayed at Grafton just at one of our um, cousin's house they just have property so we just stayed on their land in the caravan and then we ended up heading up to Helen's Vale. Helen's Vale was awesome if anyone wants to go on a holiday with children I highly recommend it it doesn't have to be for families and that but it was really good I felt really comfortable there with the kids obviously it takes a little bit to get used to your surroundings but I felt really comfortable with the kids like scooting around in those little areas because it's very quiet there's not a lot of traffic um we're quite close to like the amenities so like the pool and all of that they had a really awesome slide that was really fun um ari loved that chloe would not go on it so she was a little bit too shy to go on that sort of stuff but the pools were great um and then we had some friends that came and visited us there so that was really good that like some people from the public would come in like they just they spent a couple of hours with us and then they went one sec i'll be back Sorry, where was I? Lucas just wanted something. Um, yeah, so we had some friends visit and it was really great. Um, that next place we went to was Sandstone. We stayed at Helen's Vale for five nights, four nights or five nights, I can't remember. Um, and then Sandstone, we stayed for six nights. Six nights was way too long. It was a beautiful place, really nice. I just didn't feel as comfortable there with the kids um, at their ages. Like if they were older, they could go off and adventure around. They had all sorts of facilities that you could use but my kids were just way too young to let them go off we did have people there that we knew and they had kids but i wasn't going to be letting my kids go off and have them be responsible for my kids so i didn't want them to go where they were going so the, oh, it was very like different like i guess it was more commercialized because it was kind of resort style with like all of the pools and stuff like that um yeah and i did spend a lot of money on alcohol my, I enjoy that like don't get me wrong I do enjoy a drink and Lucas is not the big biggest drinker so I just you know was chilling on my own having a drink by the pool it was good I did have a few drinks with the, the friends that we had there as well so that was really nice but it was just nice to relax by the pool so that was really good and we packed up and came home so the kids I really feel like they've grown within themselves like it's so nice to be able to see their little personalities, personalities come to life when they actually experience different places and people and kids and just the scenery in itself it was a really enjoyable time and I do highly recommend it if you can get away whether it be in a caravan whether it be in a tent I probably wouldn't recommend going away too long in a tent it's a lot of work especially in a caravan with kids I reckon that yeah the three the last three days I was like all right let's go home I just I was over being 
in the one space with all of the family it just became a lot especially because we both work so the kids go to daycare so it's a lot for us to be together like we were for nearly two weeks um, it was still really nice but I think there's only a certain amount of time that you can go away with each other so it has been nice to get home I have so much washing so I am going to do that now I did just film a grocery haul because I had to go and get groceries so I did a quick quick and click and collect so that is going to be my next vlog coming up and I have lots of washing to do and just a little bit of cleaning because we did leave the home quite clean so that's a little um, tip if you are going away keep your house clean before you go so when you come home you have a clean house but that is pretty much it for our holiday thanks for joining us it has been a really nice time and i'm so glad to have my boy back this is mac next to us he's just having a nice little lie down beautiful boy we missed him so much he's such a good boy aren't you mate he had a, had a shower this morning so he smells fresh all right guys thanks for joining and i'll see you guys in the next one bye